smash foot on the gas I will not It's no didn't keep it low key. Uh -huh. I can carve up the D like a turkey. I run straight through the D like a train. This shit we ain't taking no losses. Uh -huh. It's all about making the game. Uh -huh. I hear a lot of trash talk. Uh -huh. He call us up making a name. Uh -huh. I put on the jets. The coast regret even letting them stay in the game. Uh -huh. See my route took a tumble. tumble. Next time be humble. be humble. I'm the lion in the jungle. Uh -huh. You just trying not to fumble. Rumble, young man, rumble. rumble. Never slip nor stumble. Uh -huh. I take off poof, magic. magic. Now watch me juke through the traffic. Footwork fantastic. Uh -huh. Dominating every facet. Magic. Treat the pocket like plastic. Uh -huh. Here come the blitz. Got it on smash, put on the gas, I will not crash, honey y'all dash, honey y'all dash, honey y'all dash, honey y'all dash, honey y'all dash. Level up at any moment. Spitting like a semi, only give me semi colon. Cobble sea rolls like I'm sending yell nets. Every flow is unmatched, and I better get set in. Finish them, finish them. Messing around with me, and I diminish them all. Even if I ever did the minimum, all. In the Arizona, better kill them all. Rogue one, but I got a team with me. Batman, when I got a thing with me. I get mean, I get green. Show the whole game what's never been seen. Cook it up, gourmet. I go Super Saiyan, go tank. Anything I ever do is top rank. Got more bars than a Shawshank. Designer sneakers hurt my feet now. Every beat is getting beat down. Couldn't eat or watch I eat now. Like, how you getting paid to freestyle? Different cities every week now. Every woman is a now. What state brought me looking bleak now? I was home to sleep designing sheets now. 30 different missions when I speak, they listen. Couldn't find the social fishing. Who the crew? It wasn't you. I know it's true because you look like the opposition. Run it up, run it up. Greatest ever sums it up. I ain't have a lot when I was coming up. Kind of made my stomach turn when I brung it up. Wait. Cook it up, gourmet. I go Super Saiyan, go tank. Anything I ever do is top rank. Got more bars than a Shawshank. Cook it up, gourmet. I go Super Saiyan, go tank. Anything I ever do is top rank. Got more bars than a Shawshank. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. With Charles Davis, as always, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, you talk about storylines in this one. I think it begins and ends with our two quarterbacks, certainly two of the best in the business. And nowadays, I don't think you can get by for long periods of time without a top-flight quarterback. The way the game is played, with all the responsibility he has and how the game flows through him, if he's not on the top of his game, your team's not going to benefit at all. the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. And that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up yardage. What's that? Right On first and ten, Newton being chased out left. And he finds the tight end, Reed. 
Give him 10 yards on the pickup, and that'll bring up a second in just about a few inches here. He was out there waving his arms, and when you got a quarterback out of the pocket looking for any help, I guess waving the arms is helpful. It certainly is, because you got to get his attention, because now you're in scramble drill. So everyone's adjusting their routes, finding open space, and he found the right spot for the completion. And he'll be brought down at the 45-yard line. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. Ordinarily in short yardage, most people don't run a toss because it takes a little bit longer to develop. But some teams see it as a very physical type run because the amount of people that get out in front of the runner, offensive linemen, tight end, sometimes an extra back, they like to run that play there and try and run over people. On first down, it's Newton. The catch made by DeAndre Hopkins. And he's got this down to the 35. A gain of 10, good for a Steeler first down. That was a nicely run slant route, and what the receiver's trying to do is make the defender think he's going upfield for a deeper route, and then breaks it off, usually after about three to four steps, and cuts towards the middle of the field. And now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defender away from the football and give the quarterback a really nice target. Facing a second and two after that last catch, good for eight yards. Now Newton, forced out to his left. And he can't find anywhere to go with it, and he goes down. Jannard Avery able to get in there and drop him behind the line. Okay, was it a breakdown in protection? Did the running back not pick him up? What does it really matter? Sometimes it's just a great play made by the defense. Big time sack. This is Newton off the play, fake to McCaffrey. Trying to get it to Jackson, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Night Train Lane. And he will take this all the way up past the 40-yard line. Well, they told us repeatedly earlier in the week in our meetings, we need some plays from our defense here on the road early. They got one. And don't think they were above all week long pointing out to their defense that the other defense is rated higher than them. You got to let that happen, guys? Is that how we're going to play? And they responded to the challenge. Now in it. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage back at the 38. Call it a full three yards in the wrong direction there. Brings up second down. On second down now, it's Smith. And that one goes for about six as he's taken down just shy of the 45. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. And the Steelers now in the nickel here on third down. On third down, Smith. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. It'll go as a gain of 10 and a Kansas City first down. All right, Charles, quick Emmett Smith story. You've heard of the Madden video game, right? I have heard of the Madden video game. Well, no it, doubt about the it. The legend goes that Coach Madden said players used to come up to him all the time and complain that their ratings were too low. The only, the only person, though, that came up and said, hey, mine's too high, Emmett Smith. You're kidding. How can you rate Emmett Smith too high? That's the question. Boy, talk about humble. That's taking modesty to a new level. Steps away to his left. The open man is Clark, complete. And he's going to be taken down here with a penalty flag on the field. Well, that's a good chunk of yardage. It's going to be canceled out. And we always talk about hidden yardage in a game. That's going to count as that because now it doesn't go on the books. But now they have to make that up again, don't they? After the penalty, it's Smith. And he's going to be taken down here still a couple yards short of the first. Give him three yards there as that'll take us to fourth down. They'll run with Smith, and nowhere to go. He's going to be stopped behind the line. He needed a couple, but he didn't even get back to the line of scrimmage. And this Steeler defense able to come up with a stop. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. 
They go back to the air here after the INT on the last drive. He's going to let this go deep for Jackson. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. He was trying to find Deshaun Jackson that time. And that'll bring up second down. To throw again. Newton. And he can't find a receiver and he's brought down. Deacon Jones. He's the one that got home and takes him down for a loss of nine. And now maybe they want some extra time to talk about this third and long play as we'll get a timeout. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Third and long, it's Newton. He's going to let this go deep for Jackson. And he fires one that's intercepted. Taylor Rapp with a pick. And he will be brought down, but he's got the interception on the final play of this first quarter. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And this offense last time turned it over, went for it on fourth, didn't get it. They're lucky, though, because no points against the team on the board, but we'll see how they respond. Yeah, they've got to get a lot of credit to their defensive teammates, don't they? They had their backs on that last series, and because they did so, that allows the coach to still stay aggressive on offense and maybe go for it again in a similar situation. I was going to say, maybe makes that offense feel good, but when you know you've got a defense making stands like that. Yeah, that'll loosen up things a little bit, won't it? Maybe it'll play a little bit better the next time you have the ball. Now a toss left side into the hands of his tight end, and they'll get it up just short of the 45 at the 44. Now a second down throw for Winston. Dancing to his left. And this is a catch by Ted Gale. And he's taken down but able to slip across the 35. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Chiefs first down. On any given pass play, you never know exactly where your exit points are going to be. On this play, he was flushed to his left, still on the run, able to accurately throw the football for a nice first down. Well, this is caught by Gale. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. It'll go as a gain of 10 and a Kansas City first down. Jameis now on first down. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And taking it across midfield and just shy of the 40. An 11 yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. Winston now to throw on first down. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Sacked by the outside backer, Telvin Smith. Protection certainly going to need to be a bit better here on second and 16. Jameis to throw it. Throw complete there to Jerry Rice. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Jerry Rice. 47 yards as his guys are first out of the scoreboard here this afternoon. Jerry Rice in the end zone is a sight we are sure used to seeing. Not only does he have the most receiving touchdowns in NFL history, he's also the fastest to get to 100. It took him, I think we, yeah, we've got it here, 120 games to get to 100. Just staggering. A staggering number, but you have to remember with Jerry Rice, it wasn't just great hands, it wasn't speed, it was the collective, the work ethic to prepare, and the route running that was second to none. This one fielded at the five. And a nifty return there as he's all the way up past the 40-yard line. At some point, we're going to get it through our heads. Special teams, special teams, special teams. The spark that often wins games. Good starting field position for them here as they come up first and 10 at the 41-yard line. Trying to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. And that is incomplete. Took a shot there on first down, but he couldn't reel it in. I know he wants to get his team back in the game, but a 50-50 ball right there that maybe was a little questionable. Yeah, he's pretty lucky to get that one back. I think that sometimes his quarterbacks play with a lot of confidence. 
that borders on arrogance, and that can put your team in some Dutch. Yeah, especially maybe you want to look at some safer routes after the interception he had that ended their last drive. And this one complete to Reed. Second quarter action with 1.59 remaining. Coming up at halftime in a little less than two minutes, we'll send you to Orlando where Jonathan Coachman is standing by. He'll have highlights and analysis of his first half. Here's Newton. And he's got the completion to Hopkins. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 37. I think it all came together there. In-breaking route. Drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there to move the sticks. Ready. Ready. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Ready. Throwing again is Newton. And look at this. Cam Newton intercepted a third time. Picked off by Jalen Mills. And a great return as he gets this all the way down close to the 30-yard line. I tell you what, credit is due there on them preventing the touchdown after that interception. How about him chasing him down and not giving up the pick six? Because what happens a lot of the time is when you see the interception, you just kind of hang your head a little bit and you momentarily pause because you're frustrated. He shook that off and gave great chase and got it done. Still a great return and very good field position. Line of scrimmage, the 31 as they line up second and 10. Winston. And Winston lost the football. And it looks like Steeler football. It is. When I see a play like that, I come back to risk reward. I don't know about you, but is it worth it at that point, whatever you're going to pick up, to either take the hit and in this case, lose the football. So should have gone down. I mean, hindsight's always 20-20, but that's the safe play. You're exactly right. Hindsight's really never wrong, is it? Because you can analyze it. But I think ultimately you got to look at it as a first option, taking care of the ball, getting what you can, and that's it. Don't worry about it anymore. First play of the drive, a success, 19 yards. One play has him up past the 40 already, and another first and 10. Newton now to throw. It's caught by OBJ. And they're well past midfield, just a yard or two shy of the 40. 17 yards on the catch and run. It's a first down. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and 10. He finds his target, Beckham. The Steelers signal for the second of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 26 seconds to go until halftime. Facing a second and two after that last catch, good for eight yards. Newton throwing again. Going right back to Beckham here, complete. And they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. Good work after the catch. Gets him 15 and a first down. Well, this is how you shake the thoughts of that interception on the last drive. You come out and start this one four for four. And watching him throw it around with that type of confidence reminds me of a guy I played with way back when who told me, I don't care if I throw 10 interceptions in a row, I'm going to stay confident and keep flinging it. I'll just figure there's something wrong with the football. Throwing is Newton. And that is incomplete. Down to 15 seconds now. Intended for Deion Sims. Brings up second and 10. So now second and 10 after the incompletion on first down. You got four. You got four. Throwing again. Newton. And he's got it. It's a pickup of 17 and a first down. Now a signal and a timeout call. As it comes with nine seconds to go in this first half of play. A chance now to get even before the break as they come up first and goal. To the air again, Newton. And caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Steelers. 
DeAndre Hopkins in the final seconds of the first half as they are now on the board here in the first half. PAT up and good by Rosas. And that is going to tie our game as we approach halftime. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. Fielded about a yard deep. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. Time here for likely one play, and then these two teams will head to the locker room all even. And you know the play call is just feeling it right now. Let's go ahead and go for this one. Of <laughs> Looking for Gannon. It's intercepted. Picked off by Jason Verrett. And he will be brought down as time is now run out on this first half of action. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. Set and ready to go for the second half. One touchdown apiece, 7-7 seven, seven our score. Fielded about a yard deep. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They have a chance to break our tie here as we get a look at the first drive of quarter three. And it's such a tone setter, isn't it? Because both sides trying to seize momentum to begin the half. What do they have dialed up that will give them an advantage to move the ball downfield? Let's find out what they have dialed up. Nice work to get seven out of that, and it's second down. On second down, here's Smith. And he'll get up to the 43-yard line. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. First down, Winston. Flush to his right. He's going to take off with it. And he'll slide down to avoid the tackle. He'll wind up getting right about four there on the scramble, and it's second down. On second down. It's Smith, and he'll get this one across midfield and down into Steeler territory. It's a five-yard gain, but they'll still be a yard short here with third down now looming. Again, it's Smith, and an alley to run! And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. It was third and short, and they go flying past the marker for a gain of nearly 30 yards. They go play action here on first down. Under pressure, and he'll go down back at the 26-yard line. Michael Pierce, in all of his 340-pound glory, gets the sack. Work to be done here on second and 16 after the sack. Winston. Oh, the man completes it to Smith Schuster. And he'll get it down this time to the 17. Eight yards on the completion, but now they face third down. On third down, Winston. Looking for Gannon, it's intercepted. Picked off by the corner, Bradley Roby. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Following the interception, here's Newton. This one complete to Niles Paul. And he's able to get this one all the way past the 30. 28 yards the gain there on the catch and run. But when you hit him on the move like that, he's able to get into open field with a full head of steam. Oh, boy, it's going to be tough to get him down. Yeah, there was a big window. They're lucky they did get him down. Now this one complete on the slant route. And he'll be tackled right on the chalk of the 45. 12 yards that time at a Pittsburgh first. On first down, this is McCaffrey. And some room to maneuver. 
And he's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. Chewing up big yardage. Another nice game there. This one goes for 20. Well, think of it like you would a typical boxing match. The person is on his heels and absorbing blows is having a tough time. And that's what's happening to the defense right now because the offense is on his toes and bunching. And there was another first down run right there. Back to the ground on first. It's McCaffrey. It's the Pro Bowl corner. Aqib Tlaib there to stop him. Tough first half for him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. On second down, McCaffrey. And they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. That one, a first down pickup of eight. Now a first down carry, it's Hill. A little second effort there on the strong run. And then drop just inside of the 20. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. Try to get one more in here before the quarter breaks. And as they come to the line, they will not be able to get off another play as time has run out on this third quarter. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. Now with Toss, this is McCaffrey. And he'll wind up losing yardage here back at the 21-yard line. This will be a loss of three and now a much tougher third down looming. One of the bigger plays in the game thus far. The crowd getting into it as we come up on a big third down. Here's Newton. And he's in. Touchdown, Steelers. DeAndre Hopkins, his second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Steelers have taken the lead. Rosas good with the extra point, and that makes the score 14 to 7. Now after the touchdown, here's Rosas on to kick it away. Fielded about a yard deep. And a pretty good return here. He'll be stopped just shy of the 25 at the 24-yard line. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. And they had a nice little drive going last time. Threw the interception in the red zone. Bad enough to throw it anywhere, but that drives coaches insane when they're thinking about, hey, we got a shot of points already. We're already in a spot where you're thinking you got three on the board for sure, and to come away with nothing, that's a really tough one for them to swallow. Yeah, will they make up for it? And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. The catch and run, good for 24 yards. On first and 10, Winston. I know most of the time when the ball's in the air, you're thinking wide receiver, tight end, but running backs, they can be a big part of any passing offense nowadays. Four yards on that last completion, so that sets up second and six. Jameis again. Again has it complete. And he works it past the 30, almost to the 25. And they're going to have themselves another first down as the tackle's made at the Steelers' 26. The drive continues as they search for a time touchdown. Here's first and 10. Going to throw right side here, complete. That goes for a Chiefs first down, 14 yards. So five plays on this drive, Charles. All passes, all completions. And just like that, they're in the red zone. And don't you think the playbook opens up a little bit more now? Because all they've done is throw the football. If you want to run it now, you may very well have them pulled. They'll run it here with Smith. And he'll be dropped at about the 11 after only a yard. And the big fella stuffed that one up in a big way. I think doubling him has to be a priority because you can't move up to the next level if you don't take care of him first. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes, and we've got a one-score game. 
So the Chiefs in possession of the ball as we welcome you back. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. And able to get him inside the five here, just inside the five to about the four. That will go as a pickup of seven on the seventh play of the drive. incomplete so he's unable to complete it there and just not the game that you would expect from him he's been off the mark really start to finish yeah it makes you wonder what exactly is going on is he a little bit dinged up here or is it just off just by a bit maybe he can get it back in this situation he need to they'll run for it here with smith and he is in touchdown kansas city Taking it in from four yards out as they can now tie the game with the extra point here in the final two minutes. Well, the hard part's done. Now they just need to split the post, tie it up, but then their defense is going to have to hold up to send it to overtime. Yeah, no matter what. I know there's an inclination in it when you have momentum to go for two here, but if you miss it, you don't give your defense a chance at all. Plus, it's been a good game. I want to see overtime. I'm selfish. <laughs> you obviously don't have a flight to catch tomorrow this one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away this will be fielded at the eight solid return pretty good field position they'll start at the 32 yard line The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. They need to get this around the 40 on the other side to get in the field goal range. Look at the clock, a decent amount of time here in a tie game. What do they do? No panic situation at all. They've got to get a couple of chunk plays, pick up nice bits of yardage, target the sidelines. Target the sidelines because you want to get out of bounds and make sure that clock stops. Because if the clock stays running, that makes things that much tougher for you. It can always bleed out on you. I know we love our jobs, and pretty much any play we see, we're pretty, you know, excited about. But big plays, let's face it, that's what we absolutely look for. How about that one? That was great, and what our camera missed was the fist pump from the sideline after that catch. They're fired out. That's a big game. Back to throw, Newton. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. The defense showing some anger after giving up the big play. This time they'll lose one or two. They'll come up after the sack on a second and 12. This is Newton off the play fake to McCaffrey. He'll buy some time right. And he can't get a throw away. He's taken down. And the Chiefs are going to signal for and be granted another timeout. As the clock will stop with 33 seconds remaining. Couple of plays sent him the wrong way, and now they face a third and 14. Now Newton. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. The amount of sacks that they've absorbed in this game is absolutely extraordinary. Let's just face it. This offensive line, flat out, cannot handle this pass rush. It's been demonstrated time and time again. Here's Brian Anger now, as he should be able to pin him back deep here with his first punt. And now a low liner. I think he mishit it. Now the Steelers use the first of their three timeouts, as the clock stops with 23 seconds to go in the game. Ready. 
The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. They have a little bit of time here to get into field goal range. Not much. In a tie game, you don't want to do anything crazy, right? I agree with you on that one. Risk reward, okay? If you go for it, what is the absolute reward on this? But the risk is probably greater. Run the clock out, get to overtime, and try and win it there. All right, we'll see if they do just that. Jameis to throw it. Buying time to his left. He's going to take off with it. And some room to work. And now look at this. Big game, but a fumble. And it looks like Steeler football. It is. It's a little teaching moment here. Overtime rules. Remind us how this goes, partner. Okay, so in the past, we had sudden death. First team to score wins, but no longer. Now, if the team receives the ball, scores a touchdown, they win the game. If they kick a field goal, though, or don't score, the other team gets a possession. And after both teams get a possession, then we're into sudden death. First team to score wins the game. So we're right back where we started. All even as the kick's away. This one fielded at the five. And he'll take it past the 25 and up to the 28-yard line. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. They control their own destiny here. They have the football in overtime. Obviously, a touchdown would win it. And I think teams around the league are still adjusting to the idea of going downfield, scoring a touchdown, wins the game because they were used to just going downfield and trying to get in field goal range to win a game. Still having to make that transition. Let's face it now. The ones who are doing it best know they need to go down, attack, put the ball in the end zone, and not leave it up to a field goal and give the other team a chance. Yeah, as we said, they control their own destiny now. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Play clock down to five, and they're going to burn a timeout. They'll be down to just one remaining as we step aside here in overtime. First throw in overtime for Newton. It's complete to Hopkins. And out across midfield, down to the 45. That one good for 26 and a first down. Fired that one in there, able to make connection on a nice in route. With those faster passes and they're going that fast, any hesitation as a quarterback that the deflection, if you miss, might be bigger and lead to an interception? Yeah, and the deflection works both ways. Maybe a defender gets a hand in the way and it pops in the air. And sometimes you throw it so hard your receiver can't handle it, and he pops it up in the air for the defender to grab as well. But a moot point there is they were able to connect. Now a toss left side into the hands of his tight end. A gain of six there on first. Ran a perfect defense in this situation. Would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and it passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was complete. That's another Steelers first down. From the red zone now, Newton. And he finds the tight end, Reed. And he'll get him inside the 15 down to the 14-yard line. Just a yard on the catch there. It'll be second and nine. They only got a yard out of that last completion. And that makes this second and nine. Again, Newton. It's caught. Beckham. And he's into the end zone for the touchdown. And the game winner in OT. A partner, a great game that we got to see and making it extra special. Not only did I get four quarters with you in this one, I got some overtime. A little whipped cream on top. Look at you. Tried to make this whole thing palatable. I just want you to pay for my meal later. Hey, you really just wanted four quarters <laughs> what you wanted. But how much fun was that? We had that type of a game where we got us to overtime, and then we get the dramatic ending to finish things off as well. What a game. So that'll do it for us, for my partner, Charles Davis, and all the hardworking men and women on our crew. I'm Brandon Gaunt. You've been watching the NFL right here on EA Sports. So long, everybody.
hundred million bag, that's a big number. Big numbers, big numbers. Whole yeah. team got it, that's yeah. a big yeah. number. Yeah. Hey, foreign cars, foreign, foreign seats with the foreign leather. Yeah. Yeah. Foreign number, put the card in the ATM in the set. Yeah. yeah, flex mode, this ain't Southwest, this a jet. I ain't gotta shut the cell off, cause the iPhone don't got a jet mode. Bad be best though. If you wanna come, let's go. We ain't going nowhere special. I just wanna see more dress though. Hit you throwing, I'ma catch those. Mexican dummy pesos. Hit you sus, I'll replace those. Number save, no name though. We need more, tell them we need more. Put numbers on the board, let like them keep a score. Hey, 16 cars in my front yard. Hey, 30 on my wrist, but I point to God. Big numbers, hundred million bag, that's a big number. Big numbers, big numbers. Whole team got it, that's a big number. Yeah, wrist man, check the wrist man, got him hot. Hey, man can't ball like this man, Lord. Pass the pig scam, when he stretch a distance. I'm talking a few hundred thousand yards, you just on your fifth grand. Run it up, 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 count it up. Hey, hundreds and fifties and twenties, no fives and no singles, don't count on them. Hey, she wanted like me, cause I blame she can't count on him. She try to be nosy and hit up my ex, she like, girl, you can count on him. Hey, hey, we need more, tell them we need more. Putting numbers on the board, let like them keep a score. Hey, 16 cars in my front yard. Hey, 30 on my wrist, what a point to God. Big numbers, big numbers. Hundred million bag, that's a big number. Big numbers, whole team got it, that's a big number. Big numbers, big numbers, hundred million bag, that's a big number. Big numbers, blue hunts, whole team got it, that's a big number. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Okay, 30,000 in the pocket, no change. Okay, I might pass the ball, but this is no game. Okay, all my girls, they love and hate me the same. Okay, so when I die, I ain't gonna be from old age. Somebody gonna want revenge, somebody might want it now. now. Right pocket got euros, euros. left pocket got pow, pow. Somebody gonna want revenge, somebody might want it now. now. Throw the ball with the right hand, catch with the left touchdown. Step back, let me get some room. Congrats every time I'm through. Say pack ain't nobody new. So I never get confused. Hotel, get a bird's eye view. Hotel, get a waiting room. Read a magazine while you wait. Brandon Gordon and Charles Davis on hand. And this is a game where the defenses, they need to be on their toes because you've got quarterbacks here, yes, that can throw the football, but they can also run it very well, too. Mobile quarterbacks. Remember for the longest time, they used to tell the quarterbacks, stay in the pocket. We don't want you outside of it at all. Nowadays, that mobility, truly an asset, and people are game planning for it. As a scout told me recently, we are actually working with what the colleges are giving us nowadays. This is taken at his four. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28-yard line. The Steelers take over first and 10 at their own 28-yard line. Ready? Seven, eight, eight. First carry for Christian McCaffrey. And he will lose yardage and be backed up to the 24. It's a loss of four on that first play, and it's second down. Nice play right there to stop him behind the line, but I want to see how this defense continues to play him here in the first half. Yeah, we know. You know better than I. He has the ability to take over a game. So what do you do? Yeah, I think you have to make sure that you bottle him in at varying levels because if you crowd everyone to the line of scrimmage, if he breaks through... It's nothing but room to run. Now the pass, and it's into the arms of Hopkins. And he'll get this one way up just shy of the 45-yard line. That one, a gain of 20 and a first down. Now a first down throw for Newton. He finds Hopkins complete. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. 20 yards on both of those plays back to back there. They are moving now. It's another first down. So from Rams territory now, it's first and 10 at the 36. 
Newton now to throw. That's complete once again to Hopkins. And he's going to get this inside the 30. A gain of 10, good for a Steeler first down. 57, Mike, 57. Newton going to hand it off to McCaffrey. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. I call that play a success. A nice inside run sets up a very manageable second down, a very solid gain on that play. Second and five down. Newton, and this one complete to Reed. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. Six yards to pick up, and that's a first down. Our game not even two minutes old, but a quick red zone opportunity. They've got a first and ten at the 15. And they're going to lose some on this play. Being knocked back to the 18. That'll set them back with a loss of three on the play. And it'll bring up a second and 13. Newton now to throw. Trying to get it to Beckham, and it's intercepted. Picked up by the Hall of Famer, Night Train Lane. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. Certainly not how they envisioned ending their opening drive here in the first quarter. Too many ones in this play. First quarter, first drive, first interception throw. And that last one, that hurts. They run with Breda. And he takes this just about a yard shy of the 20. 16 yards is the pick up there and a first down for L.A. And there we see an early burst that makes him one of the leading rushers in the league. Well, I want you to know, I listened to you yesterday when we were watching film. You said write down the word vision for him. It was on display there, wasn't it? It certainly was because he allows the blocks to set up in front of him. And if that continues, it will be a long afternoon for those guys trying to play some defense. On second and 12, Jackson. Got a man, it's Andre Reed. They'll wind up getting 10 back as that sets him up for third down. They'll try to pick this up on the ground with Breda. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. It's a gain of 11 and a first down L.A. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Jackson now. He's got the hook up here to Deshaun Jackson. It's a gain of 11 and a first down L.A. Well, coaches always talk about finding balance on offense. I don't think you can get much more balance than this. Big time run, big time pass. A one-two combination. Look pretty good. How about that? Let's see, if they, let's see if they can continue to take that kind of a punch, though. They'll get this one down near the 20-yard line. Just shy of the 20. A big run there, 29 yards and a first. Jackson on first down. It's caught by Jackson. And he'll get into the end zone. Touchdown Rams. From 21 yards away. And they are able to strike first here on their opening drive. And there they got him the ball. Just get it to him, let him do the rest. You know, he probably said that to his quarterback as he broke the huddle. I like the play call. Just get it to me. I'll take care of the rest of it. Helping out his rack, right, RAC? Run after catch, and he loves that, and he's going to carry that in at contract time. So a very short kick here. This will be taken by one of the up men. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. And this should be the final play before the quarter ends. Trying to shake off the interception. He'll look to throw. Out to the left here to Reed. And he's going to be brought down on what will be the final play of this first quarter. After 1-7-0 on EA Sports. Six yards was the pickup on the last completion. So here's second and four. Newton to throw. And that will be incomplete. Tried to dial up the long way way out there, but it'll be third down. 
Now they face a third down and four after that incompletion on second down. Now it's Newton. Blitz coming and down he goes. Now we talk about players blitzing all the time. I often laugh and sometimes call it just straight ahead pursuit. What a running start right back to the backfield for him. Yeah. And how about this, a fake? And this is incomplete. A huge gamble, and it does not pay off. They fake the punt. It doesn't work out. And that will force a turnover on downs. On first down, here's Breda. And an alley to run. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. A gain there of 12 yards and a first down L.A. Once again, they run with Breed on first down. And just a couple yards there down to the 17. That's a good play by the guys on the defensive side of the ball. Held him to a gain of two. And that changes the playbook a little bit now for the guy calling plays. Second and eight. Now he's got to probably think about going to the air instead of maybe staying with the ground game. That's caught by Andre Reed. And he's brought down just outside of the 10 at the 11. Six yards is the pickup, and that'll lead to a third down. On third down, a run from Breida. And he's going to take this one in for a Rams touchdown. Taking it in from 11 yards out. And the Rams tack on to their advantage. And they're able to run it in. It started with a battle in the trenches. They won there, and they got in for six points. And that's going to be a tough one for the defense to deal with. They've got to go to the bench now and figure out how are we going to slow down this running game because on that particular play, they had no answer. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. This is taken at his four. And good starting field position. He'll get this one all the way up to about the 35-yard line. The Steeler offense here about ready for their next drive. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does, and a lot of teams script plays. We know that, right? They, they have a script to start the ball game, and typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early, probably not very deep into their script. I think that they'll stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything. At least three points get that zero off the board. So second in inches after that first down completion went just shy of the marker. This is McCaffrey. And an alley to run. And he'll go down, but not before getting this inside the 30. A gain of 28 yards there and give him a first down. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and 10. McCaffrey. And he'll take this down just shy of the 25-yard line. Coming up at halftime in a little less than two minutes, we'll send you to Orlando where Jonathan Coachman is standing by. He'll have highlights and analysis of this first half. They try to throw on second down, but this one is incomplete. It is tough to complete pass against zone defenses. The windows that you see open, they shrink pretty rapidly. How about being able to hit a moving target against a zone before the next guy can get there and make a play on the ball? Not easy for any quarterback, no matter the situation. And there, the defense won the cam fighting. He lost the football. It's out. And now the Rams have got it going the other way. And he will bring this across midfield to the 49-yard line. The psychology of the game never ceases to amaze me because you would think there would never be a fumble from what we hear from coaches all the time, right? And how much they practice not fumbling. Practice it, preach it, talk about it all the time. You would think no one would ever turn it over. Yet they are humans out there running around. And we just saw another one. Opportunistic by the defense. On second down, Johnson. And he gets this inside the 35-yard line. It's a gain of 11 and a first down L.A. 
from the 34 now. Here's first and 10. From the gun, Jackson. And this is caught. First catch by Brandon Marshall. And they'll get this one down to about the 20-yard line. It's a gain of 15, and the Rams have a first down. Jackson and the offense come up first and 10. And he's a perfect 6-for-6 six six here to start the ball game. And he's only going to get a yard from the 20 to the 19. On second and 9, Jackson. And that'll be incomplete. Took a pretty good shot as he tried to pull that one in. Couldn't hang on third down. After an incomplete pass on second down, that'll leave him trying to convert on third and nine. Throwing is Jackson. Flushed out right. He may try and run for the... And I think the ball's out. And this is going to kick out of bounds. Boy, a fortunate bounce or two there. They'll keep possession back inside the 10-yard line. Here's first and goal, and gosh, points here. A chance maybe to put this thing away before halftime. Well, that was point counterpoint, wasn't it? They decide to throw for it on first and goal. Instead, the defense counters with pressure, and the defense wins, getting a big sack. So first down went in the wrong direction. They're at the 13-yard line. Here's second and goal. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. Third and goal, Jackson being chased out left. He can run for it, and he will. Well, this is going to depend on the spot, but it's not a very generous one. He looks to be about a yard or so short. Now the Rams will signal for a timeout their second as they stop it with 16 seconds to go in half number one. The offense is staying out there. Here we go on fourth and goal from the one. Here we go with Johnson. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Los Angeles. Chris Johnson, as the first half is winding down, and the Rams tack on to their advantage. Dawson tacks on the point after, and that makes the score 21 to zip. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. This will be taken in at the one. Then he'll take it past the 25. Skills. Yeah, how about it? How about it? You want it, you have it, you got it. What's next? 
Ain't built for the weekend. Sweet. This sugar. One man on me, but get deep. Watch what you're doing. I ain't damaged goods. Let me not the clay. Do what you could. I, I do this for the family. I might just blow my wheel. I'm keeping it so for real. Who feeling that glowing hill? I'm giving they souls the chills. My jury the cold is chill. Stories treacherous. I effortlessly show them skills. Yeah. Incredible, honestly unforgettable. You would joke like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. I just had to let you know. It's the young, incredible, honestly unforgettable. You would joke like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. Yeah. I just had to let you know. Yeah. Uh, give me that work and I can sell it. Uh. I put it on the line like I ain't selfish now. Nah. The story flip if I let you tell it. Put my heart and soul in so you feel it. I ain't never faking, I'm the realest. Since Tupac in the prison, man, claiming his innocence. Currently, I'm the greatest rapper in a sense. But any currency, I'm still guaranteed my wins. This is coming from within, I stuff for real, I don't pretend. When the OG spilling knowledge, bet it's best you soak it in. I'm a prophet to them scholars, got them chakras opening. Got them fixing up they actors, now they truly focused in. Uh. I'm seeing 2020 visions, yeah. daily manifesting on my premonitions. Yeah. Best to keep it neutral, got my own religion. The brainwash, gotta make your own decision. My word is James Bond, I stay on the mission. Coming for the top position, ain't no competition, man. Pull up in the top, it's missing, the opposition in. All that lane switching, this is what the game is in. It's the young new. Incredible, honestly unforgettable. You would joke like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. I just had to let you know. It's the young, incredible, honestly unforgettable. You would joke like Chappelle show. This so perennial. Do this for my millennials. I be murdering any flow. I just had to let you know. Big Snoop Dogg got a Madden lead. 
self-esteem is off the hook and you don't really want none. But if you do, come and get some. See, tell your mama and tell your daddy and tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Tell your mama and tell your daddy and tell the whole damn world it's Madden territory. Come get some if you want some. But you ain't bad enough, so you can't take none. I'm Big Snoop Dogg, and I'm the only one. And when it comes to Madden, All y'all fools, my sons. Ha <laughs> ha. Bag up off me and watch you lose. Snoop Dogg is on the mic. I'm giving Madden blues. And if you choose to run up on me, you gon' get laid out so fast. Cause I can get you with the run or I can hit you with the pass. I can't be touched and I can't be schemed. Roll your when I'm in a mud league. Too old, too old. Madden time on you suckers. But y'all can't get close, so why you wanna touch us? Cause my team is so hard. My team is legit, Madden 20, Snoop Dogg is, I get it. I got cleats on my feet, jersey on my back, helmet on my head, ready to attack like that. Down in Mississippi and New Orleans, big Snoop Dogg got a Madden lead. Your team is off the hook and you don't really want none, but if you do, come and get some. Let me tell your mama and tell your daddy. I was waiting 
in the shine. My father taught me don't be soft, so now I'm taking what's mine. I define myself as ambitious, young, black, and gifted. Masterpiece, my masterpiece, that mean I don't got no limits. Bout it, bout it, I doubt it. My homies know you ain't right if we break you down like a pound. I got it, don't pound us around me. I'm corrupted, flow cold, and it's rugged, bump it. What is up? I'm ready for all you got to love it. Like, black, yeah, and it feel like, ooh, yeah, all day like, ooh, yeah, all night like, ooh, yeah, whole squad like, ooh, what? And it feel like, ooh, yeah, all day like, ooh, yeah, all night like, ooh, what? Whole squad like, ooh, yeah, and it feel like, ooh, yeah, all day like, ooh, yeah, all night like, ooh, yeah, whole squad like, ooh, yeah, and it feel like, ooh, yeah, all day like, ooh, yeah, all night like, ooh, yeah. Ooh, uh, you don't want problems, you don't want smoke. Playing skills, you did. Playing, playing, playing skills. Ice on the wrist, uh, uh, car on the wrist, uh, 
Uh, uh, uh, watch out flip. Uh, watch out whip. Uh, uh, I'm in the whip. All in the wrist, uh, uh, I never switch. Uh, uh, ice in the wrist, uh, uh, car in the wrist. Uh, uh, all in the wrist, uh, uh, watch out flip. Uh, watch out whip. Uh, uh, I'm in the whip. Uh, uh, all in the wrist, uh, uh, I never switch. Uh, uh, ice in the wrist. Uh, uh, I get the money, but I never switch. They say you switch, you won't get it. You know they came from the bottom, and now we just lit. You was lit. I gotta get it, I gotta get it. You hate cause I turn the wrist. My bitch, you wanna be famous, huh? They LA the made us, huh? You know I'm icy in Vegas, huh? This for the that hate us, huh? I make a lot of new money, huh? When the it's not save us, huh? Yeah, be liking my flavor, huh? I think it's cause I turn the wrist. Call the wrist. Call the wrist. Watch out, kids. I never switch. I never switch. I never switch. I never switch. Way too many wins, they know the shit, they was hating, know they shit, 
sick, acting like they know me, cause I'm going big, going, going big. Everywhere I go, they know the click. Way too many wins, they know the shit. They was hating, know they sick, acting like they know me, cause I'm. PPP low, time to bring the bass back. Up this magic with the gang, we ball out, it can get tragic. All we got, we gon' let you let you have it. Stuck in my ways, think I need to change my habits. What would you do if you were me and didn't have it? Look in the mirror now, I'm feeling like a savage. Tell my son I love him for him, I'ma make it happen. Now my dreams reality, not going back to back to back. You say that you proud of me, I turn my back, you laughing. Now I hit the scene, they like lights, camera action. Living in a dream, now my music, they be blasting. Step out, I'm a star, always in the latest fashion. Had to set the bar, bar try to catch me lacking. Bank account for my son, he won't have to struggle. You can see it in my eyes, all I do is hustle. They try to knock me off my feet, I'm ready to rumble. Felt like I ain't eight in weeks, working off the muscle. Oh yeah, oh my, we ride for my brothers, no lie. All you, all you can die, never wrong, they right. I ain't changing my side, yeah, we in it for life. Yeah, I've been up this magic. With the gang, we ball out, it can get tragic. All we got, we gon' let you, let you have it. Stuck in my ways, think I need to change my habits. What would you do if you were me and didn't have it? Look in the mirror, now I'm feeling like a savage. Tell my son I love him for him, I'ma make Turn my back, you laugh. Hey, how could you lie to my face? People claim that they be loyal, they be taking up space. See my Roski lose his heart when he was fighting that case. Took so many yells, I'm not going back to those days. I'ma treat you how you treat me. Do you like how it tastes? Shawty, use a use a can't treat you like my ace. I got way too many problems to be worried. I'm straight. Me and Craig, Craig. Had to watch for the Jakes on the road. This road crazy. I get 80 a show. Say my money, stack it up. It look like I'm like I'm like foreign cars driving fast. I never done this before. Get get on out my problems. Let me let me. When I've been up this magic with the gang, we ball out. It can get tragic. All we got, we gon' let you let you have it. Stuck in my ways, think I need to change my habits. What would you do if you were me and didn't have? Look in the mirror now, I'm feeling like a savage. Tell my son I love him for him, I'ma make it happen. Now my dreams reality, not going back to back to back. You say that you proud of me, I turn my back, you laughing. One. Oh, I had to get back up. 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 I had to
get back up. I can't take no loss. You better call back up. Don't really need no to finish. I don't play, get down and get it. Talk about that, come slide, I'm with it. Better see me now, oh God, I'm litty. I know that you tryna go be. Better run up the cash, you love to spend. Made it, kill it, and did it again. I'm with it, ten, no, I'm down to win. I can't feel bad about it. I know you sad about it. I know you sad about it. I'm moving too fast, I can't stop. Wiping it down with the paint hot. Left hand on the wheel. I'm closing the top on the raindrop. I'm keeping the game in the headlock. When throw it blind in my dreadlock. In the end zone with the med dot. One phone call, get it dead stop. I feel like I own the season. Say one thing, just give me a reason. Knowing you're mad, I'm undefeated. Top dog, making it even. Oh, I had to get back up. Back up. I had to get back up. Sad about it, no sad about it.